King again, another one of our videos on family law issues. Today I'm going to take one that's a little bit funny, uh, but it's one that comes up a lot with our cases. About 85% of the family law cases that we have are people who are getting custody of their children. Uh, many times uh, that's the female, uh, the mother, sometimes it's fathers getting custody, and occasionally it's grandparents. But I want to talk specifically to our women who are going through the separation process. Calling this so you have a new boyfriend um, because that comes up so often and the reality is that new boyfriends are oftentimes the issue in a case many times uh, a mother is clearly suited to be the primary custodian of the children but then they bring in a boyfriend uh, one thing that I would like to warn you about is hey life goes on the judges understand that that's going to happen but when you make a decision that you're going to move a person into their life, then it is going to be a trial about that person. Let me make it clear. The new boyfriend should not be physically disciplining your children. Let me underscore. No spanking from the new boyfriend. This person better not have a criminal record. And I don't care how much you love him or how long that he's been around. Understand the court is going to be suspicious of this new boyfriend who's now becoming a very serious player, if not a more serious player than the father in that person's life. I strongly urge you to take a deep breath before you enter into a new relationship. But when that happens, make sure you understand and that person understands that they are now going to be the person who is under trial. So when it comes to a new relationship, make sure that we at the law office know about them. So when you say, so I've got a new boyfriend, you're ready.